Terrible is going to be have, have to be on point in just not letting KMX get away, run away with a lead. Yeah. So yeah. Oh, and already just 39%. Sonic just in your face. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's the thing about Sonic is even if they run away the whole game, if they're cl go close to you, yeah. you can get at 80%, 90%. So I think it, this character is going to be a bigger, bigger threat as the meta progresses because they just have such good defensive options and with so much diversity in their attack. Yeah. And but and Terra Boy just ending it. That. Yeah. <laughs> Card into upbeat. Yeah. Oh, and right there, um, we saw the two side Bs clash, and that's an interaction that Bowser Jr. is always going to win. So. It is something pretty unique to this matchup that, um, despite the tier difference, Bowser Jr. has some counterplay to that spin dash. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, and forcing his way back onto stage. Great job for a Terra Boy. And Kamek needs to find something quick. Yeah, right there again. Side beam on the spin dash, just totally shutting it down. Yeah, okay, up smash going to take it right there. But 97%. And he's definitely bleeding. I see those numbers are red right now. Ooh. Yeah. You can Z drop it in. Well, I'll get hit, I believe. Yeah. Oh, uh, can you? It's I'm like something unique, I think, with the Mecha Koopa, but I might just be making that up. Yeah. But I feel like Terraboy does I, do that pretty often. Yeah. I do know it can random drop. So, oh, that might have been it. That so it just, like, and it's still active. I'll just. Fading back with it. Yeah. And Unique Sonic, like, after they homing tag shield, they usually air dodge. But it's, like, such a mix-up that if they commit to that oh. or not, they're making it back. Bowser Jr. able to come back from deep. I think they're going to let that cross stage, but 150. 150, but this is scary. If you can't close out the stock against Sonic, Sonic will very quickly bring it back. So, yeah. Um, Speeds his game, man. Yeah, terribly... He can't let the he can't let his hundred percent lead make him rest easy. Yeah, really yeah. good closing it out right there. All right. Oh, okay, <laughs> that actually looks dope. <laughs> yeah, it, it is cool, and I think um, if they were a bit more on point, they could have actually gotten more from that off the dare. I yeah. believe you can get a grab or an, an upper string. Ooh, and rain the jump. Okay, get up attack to get out the situation. Good job. Yeah. Well, maybe they're able to do it. Yeah, it seems intentional, but um, but I'm not quite sure. Yeah, so, some Bowser Jr. main will let us know. And right now, Kamex is kind of becoming the antsy one, trying to close out the stock against Terra Boy, and does manage to do it. So let's see if Terra Boy can just not let Sonic rack up too much before they get a kill move. Yeah. Well, yeah, 120%. Definitely going to be hard for Kamex to, like, even try to recover from it. And Terrible is still trying to, like, somewhat keep the pressure on. A lot of people just opt to, like, either, like, full, be fully aggressive or, like, fade back. But Terrible is trying to play somewhere in the middle. But maybe not deciding is the war is not the move because 70% dealt onto them. Yeah, and Kamex does like to go for that. Uh, able to, like, close out stocks on a lot of players if they're just not aware of that situation. Yeah, and Kamex has been at this, like, 120% range for such a long time. Terrible just has not landed a hit because he switched his game plan up from just trying to get reads on Sonic in neutral to trying to get a kill move, and it's yeah. just been devastating for him because Kamex has been playing around it so well. Yeah, it looks like he's going for even harder reads than what he was in the beginning. Yeah, maybe some nerves coming out. You know, you want to oh, close it, it out, but that is it. Yeah. Okay. Jabs killing in this game is ridiculous. Yeah, <laughs> uh, Bowser Jr., one of the best jabs in the yeah. game for sure. Who, who else jabs killed? Bale. Bale is now, yeah, yeah. got buffed. Um, Crom's in a way. Does yeah, <laughs> Crom Roy. <laughs> yeah, a, a little of an extension, but yeah. same concept. <laughs> 
right there. Yeah, I think really good on Terrible. Just, I think they were just holding A right there because they knew yeah. Sonic was gonna spin dash into that. And I bl I wonder yeah. if they can always get the jab after the clank or yeah. if KMX didn't react. It looks like they could. But yeah, now we're playing on Town and City. Original Sonic colors too. Yeah, no, I feel like no Sonics used this. We gotta. Yeah. I, I like this. It's a nice shade of blue. It's, it's the original man. Original Sonic. I, I don't understand why they like the variants. I, th I thought they were fans. Yeah, some fans. The rare chainsaw. Just dash attack. It's connecting. Yeah, that that move is, is funky for sure. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Oh, that, that was last. That was so lasting. Oh yeah, that move. It, it's really. Oh. oh. <laughs> that was that was big brain. <laughs> yeah, it, it almost went real far. That would have been a, maybe even a stock. Yeah. But um, yeah, Bowser Jr. does have a good amount of blasting moves. The lasting hitbox is side B, and the fair lasts a long time in the air, and then has an additional landing hitbox. And lasting moves are really strong against Sonic because if you know the spin dashing, you can shut it out. So yeah. Terraboy has been using those really well. It's just been a matter of closing out stocks. It's been a struggle for him. Yeah, and it looks like Hammock's like truly adapted to this playstyle. You saw saw him come back like during towards the end of the last game. But oh, oh. outsmarted. Yeah, straight <laughs> up read that jump. Knew that he was going to try to get out of that situation. That's a, and that's a, like that's a moment where you feel like, yo, I'm, I'm the better player. Yeah, <laughs> I, I hope um, Terraboy does get some confidence off that because it's really scary being down percent against Sonic. Yeah. Kamek seems to just not be wavering. This is really scary. He's applying a lot more pressure. Okay, racking up damage, 44%. And Town City, they both kill off the side. Both these characters kill off the side mainly, so... Basically, it's suit both of them, and I see why um, Kamex wanted it because he gets to run a lot more, camp out, and kill with back air a lot sooner or sp spin that spare. But Terraboy is just able, also able to kill with his spare of his own air and cart. Cart and cart up B, especially, which we actually saw the first the first stock of the first game kill Kamex at a very early percent. So yeah. that probably would be one of the few things that could get Terraboy back in this game because having a lead against. Uh, having a deficit against Sonic on a stage like Town. You know, get you saw, real out of yeah. hand. You saw that up to Yeah, that was interesting. <laughs> Looking like Pit. <laughs> Alright, Spin Dash. Spin Dash Cart. That's, that seems to be the name of the game with this neutral right now. But Terraboy is down, so he's, he's trying to look, find something to happen. Oh, not Ooh, just not yet. Killing, but that's and that's probably the highest percent you're gonna land that. Oh, what the yeah. the coverage right yeah. there? Just knows. Oh, that only happened because he's disjointed. <laughs> yeah, and Kamex has been jumping a lot at spin dash like very quickly because they know Terraboy likes to put out a hitbox in the incoming spin dash. So he just quickly jumps right away. Yeah. And maybe Terraboy is catching on to that, running up and up smashing yeah. it. Said, I'm not waiting anymore. We're just gonna do it. Trying to wait for an incoming, not just yet. That, yeah, that's a frame trap. Yeah, a scary one. Terraboy, um, I think if I, you gotta try getting a smaller stage if you were hitting my thing. Yeah, I feel like you want, um, like maybe a Smashville or even like Battlefield might be just perfect because you get to work with the platforms. Yeah, anything that can make it so Camex can't just um, react to yeah. what your defensive option is going to be and rather has to read you because yeah, there was we, a lot of that stock where Kamex was just sitting in spin dash and waiting to see if Terraboy did like a jump fair side B and then at reacting accordingly. So yeah. if, if uh, Terraboy can give Kamex not that space to play neutral like that, it, it yeah. can be huge. It looks like we're getting FD, the final destination, with some inkling music they're trying to set up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't approve. Yeah, I'm, I'm not big on this. <laughs> yeah. Good, great job. We're all we're all adults here. <laughs> music for little children. I, I need some Tekken music to actually play in. <laughs> yeah, you, you can pick any song in this thousand thousand playlist uh, or thousand song playlist, and, and you chose Splatoon music. Yeah. 
Gonna, gonna have some firm words with Terraboy after this set. It's like, yo, I love Splatoon, though. <laughs> yeah, also, I know for a fact he was not play Splatoon, so. <laughs> Alright. It's so scary right there when you're just staying in shield and have a charge spin dash. Yeah, and you see both players just playing now more defensive than what they were doing originally. Yeah, they, they both just know how vital how, or how devastating it can be to give one of them an extension. So they, they're just so scared of each other and like these starting spots because a lead can go so far. Yeah. That's a read, but yeah, this time. just a bit, bit late on that. Oh. Oh my God! What's what's this music? <laughs> Okay, yeah, and this hard read is just not working out. I believe this music was a tactical choice by Terror Boy to make it so Sonic doesn't camp because they want the game to end. So, oh. really, oh. really great play. Yeah. <laughs> Driving for perfection. And you saw that cannibal this year. It's still a lasting hitbox. Um, chat, if you guys didn't know. And if you get hit by it, you can potentially die. It has so much knockback. Yeah, it, it's, it, it like will come down from the sky and you're just not ready for it. Yeah. And that back is huge because this this can just be this whole set right here if Kamek is able to run away with the stock. Yeah. Like what he did game two. And he's picking up the Mecha Koopa. And I have not agreed with any of those uppies um, Terraboy has done. Yeah, they seem desperate for yeah. sure. He's like trying to bank on Sonic spin dashing at him. But is just not able to react. And he's just doing them preemptively. All right. That stock right there. Oh, no, no yeah. Barely. I, I was wondering why they didn't F-Smash. They have so much time if Sonic gets that laggy landing. Yeah. But might as well have killed because they did not take any more hits after getting that. Oh, oh, oh. that could have been huge. But 62 could be a lot worse, honestly. Terraboy can get this percent back pretty quickly and have an even game. Yeah. But Kamex just staying right there. Oh, oh the one time Kamex came in. Yeah, Terraboy was ready. And this is now a lead for Terror Boy. Yep. Taking pretty much no damage, I think, since um, since they've killed them. Just waiting. Oh, that roll. Thought they were going to roll behind, but unfortunately not. Wow. We really have not seen many grabs come out from Kamex right there. So he's now trying to mix it up in these last moments of the set. Yeah. And I, I like to go under the stage um, tactic. Just they didn't want to deal with the S smash right there. Yeah, and they also instantly snapped a ledge this time, and I don't think Kamex was ready for that because they have been going like air dodging through the ledge and then uh, yeah. doing the attack. So, Terror Boy and Kamex both trying to mix up some options here in these final moments. And uh, stuff you save for the final game, man. All right, Bear. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Really good pressure from Kamex right there. Caught it. Let's jump again. This is looking really rough. Yeah, yeah. and that, that up he's telling of Terraboy's mentality right now. He yeah. is very anxious about getting this stuff. He just wants something. Yeah, it looks like it just falls out random. <laughs> Oh, Ooh. the drive-by. Yeah. <laughs> Great call out right there. Showing Sonic that Ter uh, Bowser Jr. has the burst option to make it so you can't just freely go up and down like that. Yeah. All right. And yeah, so much lag right there from the homing attack. But Terra Boy nowhere in sight. Oh. <laughs> Wait. Oh, if it fell down, that would have been funny. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, good up there on that spring. All right, caught him. Yeah, Kamex has been throwing these F smashes out on ledge, and I don't think it's ever worked for him. Yeah. Oh. This is really scary, though. Back throw. Not going to take it right there, but puts him in such a bad position. Spring, not going to do it. Yeah, trying to read the jump from ledge. That F tool does start killing at high percent, so. Yeah. Oh, and yeah. a missed tech. That sucks. Yeah, that's it's such a brutal set to lose, especially game three. You know, you play you play a really focused game three game set just to get uh, gimped by a spring in 
a six minute game. So yeah. Terraboy gonna try sh hopefully shake that off, but good job on Camex. They they definitely showed clear adaptation there, you know, at least showed why they're getting these wins. Cause they were switching it up. They weren't letting Terraboy get the same thing over and over. They yeah. made Terraboy adapt as well. Yeah, gotta make them work for it. Right now we have Vivi versus King of Wizards, who I believe is an invader. Okay. So this could this could be up in the air. Yeah. So yeah, King of King of Wizards, like 